We memorize, we learn, and we succeed. Let's work on our sixes today. Here they are. Our first one will be six times zero equals, and then six times 10, and six times nine, six times eight, six times seven, six times six, six times five, six times four, six times three, six times two, and six times one. Question for everybody, did you get them all right that quickly? If not, you want to, so let's try them again. This time, in a different order. So which one will be first? Six times three, six times 10, six times five, six times seven, six times six, six times four, six times eight, six times zero, six times two, six times nine, and six times one. Again, did you get them all right? That quickly. If not, it's okay. Let's try again and you have to keep working on them and get them memorized. All right, one more time. Six times nine, six times six, six times 10, six times five, six times eight, six times seven, six times four, six times three, six times one, and six times two. Now the answer key is coming up next, so you'll be able to study them if you don't have them all just yet, that's fine. Hopefully you and all your classmates and friends get these right soon. So here come the answers. And they look like they're jumbled up, but I believe we're gonna do them in order for you. Six times zero is zero. Six times one is six. Six times two is 12. Six times three is 18. Six times four is 24. Six times five is 30. Six times six is 36. Six times seven is 42. Six times eight is 48. Six times nine is 54. And six times 10 is 60. If you don't know all of those by heart, just leave the screen there and memorize those. Or come back and watch often until you have them. Just get them all memorized, kids. It will help you throughout your entire mathematical career know your multiplication facts. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it.